what's my FIFO food like. In this video, I'm going to show you all the FIFO food options that I have up here whenever I'm on site. I'm going to bring us into the mess and show you the different breakfast options that we have. Then I'm going to show you what dinner is normally like and then dessert options after dinner. And then also I'm going to bring into the crib room, which is where we organize our smoko, which we have at 10 a.m. And then also our lunch, which we have at 2 p.m. In these next couple of clips, I'm going to show you what it's like. Uh, so yeah, here we go. Yo! So this is our mess. Uh, well, we call it a mess, but it's essentially just a big cafeteria, dining room kind of thing. There's this one, and there's also one that's a mirror image of this one right beside it. So there's two of these, and the food options are pretty much the same, and everything's the same. It's just to sort of uh, control the amount of numbers. Uh, I think we have like 1,600 people up on our site. This here is one of the juice stations. There's a couple of these dotted throughout the mess. It's just where you get water and lime juice and stuff like that. There is one of the only videos I got of the bre breakfast options. Just because, like, I don't really get... I hardly ever eat breakfast anyway because it means you have to get up, like, even earlier than you already do. And you get up fucking stupidly early anyway. So, uh, yeah, not, I don't really have breakfast at all. So, as you can see, it's just all sort of, like, fry stuff. Then you have, like, granola and, like, natural yogurts and all that kind of stuff. Then cereals options as well. Uh, I have this with like some yogurt for for one of my for one of my crib meals, and yeah, there's milk for your teas and coffees, your cereal or whatever. This here is now coming into the all the dinner options. I just take took a couple of clips of like the the buffet kind of thing, like on a couple of nights. So yeah, just to give you an idea of like there's chips there, uh, egg fried rice, uh, sweet potatoes, uh, veg, all that kind of stuff. This here is the buffet of another night. Same again, veg, sweet potato, carbs, and then you've got your meats at the end as well. So, uh, yeah, good variety every night. I try and change it up, but it's sort of generally the same thing. But, uh, yeah, it's dead on. Now, my favourite thing about the food up here is you're able to order from the chef either chicken or steak. That's what I have most nights. I have a grilled chicken and a bit of steak. That's there. It's right, one of those wee dockets. And this is sort of typical dinner I'd have every night. It'd be steak, chicken, veg, and gravy. There's just an another option just to, yeah, show you a different night as well. There's mash and rice and all sorts of stuff. And then uh, that night I remember there was like, uh, yeah, those yummy barbecue ribs. They're actually sweet to be fair. This next section is all about the desserts. And let me tell you, it is very, very hard to walk past this after your dinner and not take anything. I try and stay away from it as much as I can. But I do have a wee cheat every now and again if I've had a grim day just as we pick me up. But uh, yeah, it's very hard to stay away. Just uh, yeah, have a look at all the little buns and the cakes are absolutely sweet. Some people completely pile their plates high. I'm very, very jealous, but I'm trying to lose my bong belly before my trip. And there's also ice cream options for anyone with a sweet tooth. Right, we're now in the crib room here. I'm going to make up my smoko and lunch. This here's one of the freezers. You get pizzas, sausage rolls, pies, pasties, all that kind of stuff. I'm now at the ready meal fridges. Here you can get sort of like granola and yogurts and there's like sandwiches. And over here is like toasties and shit you can put in the toasty makers whenever you get into your crib hut. Here's the ready meal options that could be microwaved. These get changed up pretty regularly. But uh, yeah, I generally don't take anything from these fridges. But a lot of people do. But whatever floats your boat. There's little bun options, burger bops, uh, loaves of bread and stuff to make sandwiches with. That's what I generally take. And these are all the meats you can put in the sandwiches or salads or toasties or wraps or whatever you want. And then this little section is like condiments and then down the bottom here is more just sort of like healthy veggie kind of shit that you can put in sandwiches or wraps or whatever you want really so uh, yeah there's olives peas lettuce rocket rice cheese anything you want really uh there's just me making up a little sandwich for for my lunch uh so yeah that's what i have most days it would be a sandwich or a wrap or uh some sort of yogurt and nuts and stuff like that and down here is just more sort of like uh pasta salads and couscous salads and yeah sometimes down here they have like nachos and things like that and then there's just more fruit options you can have cake options that i try and stay away from and then also at the end here those yogurts and sort of fruits and shit and you can also take loads and loads of fruit as much as you want and yeah loads of good options